Hey guys! Hey! Yeah, hello! <laughs> Finally, you don't understand. This is the place. So, um, we're gonna go in there and get some hot salt beef bagels. Yay! We just left um, the bagel shop on Brick Lane and I feel shit. bagel it looks really nice but the guy in the shoe spoiled my mood <laughs> the service in that place is horrendous and it was just rude um i don't know i feel shit like i genuinely feel shit we were looking forward to it so when we went and he was just rude it was kind of like well it's not worth it, I don't want to eat it. Flavor of the food, tastes, 10 brownies, 10 out of 10 straight. No doubt about that. It was like amazing bagels and amazing. Like the bagels were chewy, but also like kind of like hard on the outside. I had a bite with a lot of mustard, it just went through my nose. But um, the beef was amazing. It was a melting in the mouth. It's perfect, perfect bite as well. That's why it was a bit too much. Like I didn't have enough bagel for my beef. So I would love to have more um, bagel. Like I would have spread that meat for two bagels or have less beef on the bagel. But it was amazing food. Now the one criticism I do have, customer service, I would give it, I don't know, I can't decide because the lady was really nice and the guy was very rude. Um, I mean, not because he said no to us, the way he said it and also um, the way he was gossiping to his co-worker about us and we can hear it. For that, I will give two brownies. That's for the nice, lovely lady at Bagel Shop. The one guy working there, he was, I thought was rude and he wasn't nice at all. So I wouldn't personally want to go there. But we are going to check another bagel shop. Um, it's Bagel Bake, the next one. It's right next to it. And apparently that's the one we're supposed to go to. Um, I didn't realize. So um, we're going to check that out. We're going to get another bagel there. And. Um, we will compare! <laughs> 